Hey Coco, do you know what today is? Ipsy. It's Boxy Charm. It's not Ipsy. Well, it, it will be Ipsy because we're going to film Ipsy after this. But right now, it's Boxy Charm Day. Well, Boxy Lux. Hey, everybody, we are back. If you're new, thanks for joining us. I'm Shannon. That's Coco. Click that subscribe button, please. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. Okay, y'all, we're going to go over this Boxy Lux. Let me tell you the thing that's really been pissing me off is they used to send an email and it would say, like, hey, you get to pick your choices. Oh, now they don't do that. You have to go in before a certain date and you have to do it. And yeah. I never remember like I'll be like oh yeah let me check and it'll be like oh you can't pick for like another week and I'm like okay I'm gonna check in a week and then I completely forget until I get the email that says my box is on the way and then I'm pissed off because I'm getting whatever random crap which you're getting whatever random crap they want to send you anyway but this is like the worst of the worst crap also I got a new hairstyle going today I don't know let me know what you think because I was like curling it and I had this up because I was curling the bottom and I was like that kind of looks cute I, am I too old to do this pull this off but I like it so I'm doing it. Yeah, I don't have my glasses on and when I don't have my glasses on I can't read very well I'm not yeah. gonna lie. So we have um, Patrick Star one size fits all secure the blur. It's a primer $30. I'm not mad at this. I'm not mad at this. Generally speaking I like well I only have a couple of things from him uh, two foundations one was darker so I used it as a bronzer and the yeah. puff pad she got brushes for Christmas. Yesterday was Christmas, so happy post-Christmas. Yeah. So I'm excited for this one, I guess. I mean, I just found the Nude Sticks Blur and Blot primer, and I'm obsessed with yeah. that. So um, I'm not mad at this, but it's not, yeah, I don't know. But I've loved, I, I have loved Patrick Star for 10 plus years. I've been watching him on YouTube, so, and he's Filipino, so you know, Pinoy Power. Anyway, let's. Pinoy Power? Pinoy Power! This hey. Filipino. Filipino? Yeah. Okay, then we got this palette, which I was just like, okay, whatever. It's the Best Dress Lids from Mali. $45. Um, $45. I don't have anything from this brand. I know a lot of companies are going to paper because it's recyclable and eco-friendly and all of that. But for the price you're charging people, give me something better than this. I'm I'm not gonna lie. I don't have anything from Mali. I'm not really familiar with the brand. I haven't used any of their products. I'll block Coco's face out. So this is what the palette looks like. And I'll be honest, it reminds me of a palette this company put me on their PR list. Let me see if I can find it, because th that's what this reminds me of. Okay, I can't find the palette. I have no clue where I put it, but it's from um, What's Up Beauty or What's Up Cosmetics. It looks really similar to this. I don't know if it's the packaging or what, but this is, I'm not like. This is not good. I'm yeah, I'm not impressed with this as a, a luxe box item. I just, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna swatch it or I'll put it away for a giveaway or something. So we'll put this to the side for a giveaway or something. I really need to do a giveaway because I have so much stuff that I keep putting to the side for giveaways and then don't do the giveaways because life happens. Um, next we got this from Duel of the Gods. We've gotten other products from Duel of the Gods and I do like the brand. So this is two lace sponge sheet masks, Saturday and Sunday. So one is a cold elixir made from squalene and citrus. The other one is restorative. We got like a mud mask from them and it was like a green teal kind of color and I loved it. And I want to say we got something else from them before. I don't know if I loved it, but I probably wasn't mad at it because I do like this brand. So I'm, it's okay. It's an okay product. And price for that is $40 because this is not a cheap brand at all. I'm not gonna lie, $20 for one sheet mask is kind of expensive, so probably what I would do is like use it, take it off, put it back into its packaging, put it in my little fridge, my little beauty fridge, and reuse it again. I'm not gonna lie, I've done that before. Uh, because I am cheap. <laughs> yeah, let's leave it at that because I'm cheap. Okay, then we have a uh, lipstick from Fenty Beauty. This is $26. It's in the shade Uncensored 01. So this is the second time we've gotten a lipstick from this brand, from Rihanna's brand. And the first one was like a bright pink. Now we have this reddish color. I don't... I'm not gonna lie, I don't wear red. So I guess we'll just save that for a giveaway also because... Not only do I not really wear reds, I don't know, where is it at? Um, back there. 
Okay, there. I don't and think maybe. you can see it, but by the Dior box, there's a black purse thing. And it's like um, four Dior lipsticks, and you can carry it in the purse thing. But a lot of them are reds, and I got that for Christmas. So I yeah. really don't need more reds. I have enough reds. And then we have this from Herbivore. It's 50 bucks, 48 bucks really, but 50 bucks. Um, it's Cloud Jelly. I gotta put my glasses on so we can see what this Cloud Jelly is. Oh, my glasses are dirty, y'all. Okay. Um, a non-sticky hydronic acid alternative serum that helps dry dehydrated la, 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 la. dehydrated skin bounce back. So I guess like the day after you do like some major exfoliating, like overnight exfoliating, it would be good to do this to put some moisture back into the skin. I don't know. Let's let's open it. It's got strawberries and mushrooms on it. It's cute. It's got cute packaging. It's pink glass little dropper thing. Let's smell it. It doesn't have a smell. It's not sticky. It is not sticking. They weren't lying. It's very lightweight and watery feeling, like a water-based something. I wish I was Christmas. We had a good Christmas. I got some amazing gifts. Well, you see the setup is different. So I will have a video coming out with me putting all of this together. And it was it was a disaster of a mess, but we do have the Vanity Impressions desk back there now, the Slay Station, and then the their version of the Ikea Alex drawers, and then I still have my Alex drawers over there also. But the room looks really nice now. Okay, we got this, which I was confused. I was like, why would you send something like this when you have no clue what shade I actually am? This is Hydroflex Serum Foundation, $39. Now the thing is, I just recently started taking the online makeup school um, courses, so I'm learning about things that I didn't really know about before, even though I've been doing makeup for 27-ish years. I've learned about how to tell about the different undertones and, and skin tones and all of these things. So now I'm like, you don't know my undertone. You don't know my this, you don't know my like, so why would you send me this? It's in medium tan sand. I will not lie to you though, while I'm complaining about them sending me this and just guessing my shade because I say I'm tan, I could be anywhere on the spectrum of tan, they just picked one. I did put this on my, I think I just put it like right here and it, it worked. So it, it did work like in this area. This foundation I have on right now, when I put it on, I was like, whoa, that is way darker than I need, and it is orange, but this is what I used to wear, and we are in freezing winter. And when I say freezing, I mean it's literally freezing outside. The foundation that I have on actually does not match, match my face at all. And my hands are significantly darker than my face when I don't have makeup on, so I wanna say this worked. It feels really lightweight. I feel like this has a good bit of coverage for as lightweight as it feels. What is this supposed to do? I'm sure it's supposed to do something magical to your skin. It's the Yoga Pants of Foundation. Hydroflex technology moves with your skin, won't crease medium coverage. I don't know if that's gonna work, y'all. I don't know. Okay, then we got two more things. How long has this been? 15 minutes, jeez Louise. We got Youth Foria. Youth Euphoria. I don't know what this brand is. What is, oh, oh, I remember I put this on like the cocoa, I think. I think I'm, this is like a blush, but it like changes or something. Let me see. It's an award-winning, first of its kind, color-changing blush oil, $36. Now this was an intriguing little thing. Okay, so it looks just like it's a gloss. Okay, so can you kind of see it changing already? Because it's literally clear. It looks green for some reason. But it really, it's its just clear. She really wants y'all to see her Christmas gifts. I don't know, it changes to like a pinky-ish color. We'll let it sit for a minute. Let's go over the next thing. The next and last thing. This is Dear Midnight. What the hell is that? Oh, set to last, it's a setting spray. $30. $30 for a setting spray now I've never heard of. Sponges. Okay, she got sponges too, guys. She got sponges in like a little egg carton thing. Yeah, they're like bunnies. They're yeah. like bunny eggs. Like bunny eggs. Yeah. Baby bunnies don't lay eggs. Chickens have eggs. Bunnies don't have eggs. Yeah. You're thinking of the Easter bunny. Okay. Well, the packaging is really cute. Really pretty. This is a thick plastic. It's not glass. It's a thick plastic. I'm not mad at this packaging. It's got a really big push sprayer thing. Let's see. It has a scent. I, I feel like I smell patchouli or something. It's taking me back to my, 
my hippie mom's um, life. Not my, me being a hippie, but my mom being a hippie and having like oh. patchouli and then like soap that you could also use as toothpaste okay. and... Yeah. Okay, so we can kind of see it changing here, but it is, it's like putting a gloss on your face. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't put this. I don't want my cheeks to be glossy or greasy or shiny like this. This is not drying down at all and I feel like it doesn't really give you enough pigment you could just use like a, a stain or you could use a rare beauty blush and then put your foundation on top if you wanted like more of a natural glow coming out but this is a no for me okay so that's the box I'm not mad about these products I'll definitely use this I don't have a problem trying anything from Patrick Star what I have used from him I did like we'll see about this I don't I don't, I, this is weird, I don't want this. Why, why would I want this? I'll use this because I have it, and then I'm not gonna, anytime they send me a setting spray, I don't use it. I use my normal like Max, Mac Fix Plus or whatever. I don't use all the random ones that they send me. So no, don't do that. Anyway, that's our Boxy Lux. not the best. It's not the worst, we've had worse, okay? But it's definitely not the best, so that's all I got. <laughs> That's all I got, people. Please subscribe and like the video. Like, subscribe, uh, comment, share, click the bell, all those good things. Bye. bye. <laughs> I need coffee. Oh, bye. that's good. Ready? Yeah. Ready. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm pretending I had a fever. <laughs> what is this on my face? What is that? Yeah, you had to wipe it off. What is it? Oh, is that just part of my skin? Oh, did I get scratched? I think I got scratched. Okay, you can't see it. Brand new. It's the brand. I'll show you. Oh, is that your new Christmas palette? That Christmas palette. Okay, you want to show them? So she got this palette and one of the shades fell out right here. She's a little disappointed, but that's okay. That's okay. Yeah, I like these. Oh, she got some brushes in her stocking. Yeah. Santa gave her brushes. Yeah, and another brush. I got two now. Because I wanted to. Oh, you wanted to? Yeah. Oh, I nice. Well, I wanted these for my birthday. Oh, okay. Now I got them for Christmas. Coco got a lot of toys, got a lot of makeup, got lipsticks, brushes. Everything. Yeah. Got a Marc Jacobs palette, a MAC palette. Jacob Marcus? Marker? Marker Jacobs. <laughs> oh, yep, that's the Marc Jacobs palette. I used it. Yeah, she used it. I love it. I never knew this. <laughs> Are you excited to show everyone your makeup? Yeah. I see. Have a good day. You have a good day, too. And goodbye. <laughs> it's over. It's over.